YouTube, I hope everyone is having a fantastic day. Today, I wanted to showcase a Freddy build that generates a ton of pressure while also catering towards the Nightmare's power. I know a lot of people have stopped playing Freddy over time with some of the kit changes and nerfs that have come his way, but I honestly feel like his mobility, map pressure, and even chase power have a lot of potential to be unlocked. I had a lot of fun and success with this build, and I think it's definitely one killer should give a go and survivors should be on the lookout for. I'll leave timestamps in the video and description below, but let's jump right on into how this build works. Alrighty, so first up on our perk list, we have Scourge Hook Pain Resonance. Whenever we hang a survivor on a Scourge Hook, the generator that has the most progress will explode, losing 50% of its progress, and it will instantly begin regressing. This perk is going to be a big source of pressure for us and help us stay ahead in our trials. Uh, next up, we have Thrilling Tremors, which activates whenever we pick up a down survivor. Any generator that isn't being repaired will be blocked by the entity for 16 seconds, and this perk is going to help us with tracking uh, during our matches. Next up, we have the perk Surveillance. Uh, uh, any regressing generator will be highlighted in white, and if the regression is interrupted, the gem will be highlighted in yellow for 16 seconds. Additionally, uh, generator repairs are audible at an additional 8 meters as well. And then the last up on our list for today, we have Jolt. Anytime we put a survivor into the dying state with a basic attack, all generators within 32 meters will explode, begin regressing, and instantly lose 8% of their progress. All right, and then lastly, we've got uh, two lovely add-ons here. First of all, we have the Z-Block and Swing Chains. Um, these add-ons aren't necessarily essential for the build and you could definitely change these up for anything to your liking uh the z block is just going to grant us uh the hemorrhage status effect on survivors who interact with our dream snares and also going to cause them to leave trails of blood even when healthy uh and then the swing chains are just going to increase the sound of survivor footsteps by 50 percent but that is uh the whole build right on there and uh we'll get ready to jump on into some matches and see what we can do with this all right, so it looks like we are spawning on into the Ironworks of Misery. I love this map. Uh, so let's get uh, ready to hop on in, see what we can do. I think, uh, firstly, we're going to kind of head back towards, uh, back of the map, kind of back towards Shack and a little bit to the left as well. Uh, my guess is the survivors are kind of a little bit just on this left side here, but we're going to take a little look see around, see what we can find, and uh, hopefully we'll get started on our first chase soon and uh, get these perks rolling on into action, see what we can do. Alrighty, uh, so I don't think we have anyone there. Oh, beautiful, there's Rebecca. Well, let's start here. We're gonna do a little bit of a tiny mind game. We'll play. See where she heads. I think she'll probably be, ooh, upstairs. Good choice, honestly. Great choice there. All right, um, we'll follow her up. We're definitely gonna have to get rid of a breakable wall here, uh, but that will help us later if anyone else uh, chooses to loop that main building. Drop dream snare as well, just in case. And good drop. Nicely done, Rebecca. Beautifully played. All right, head out this way. Uh, we're going to fake just a projection quickly. Get a little bit of, uh, maybe, you know, a little bit of pressure going there. Ooh, beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, <laughs> smoking a little early. All right, let's let's uh, let's drop a snare here. Beautiful. Chase her around this side. She'll make it. Well played. Ooh, and I like the dead arm. That was massive. Well played. All right, let's go ahead and uh, get rid of this pallet. Nice job to the Rebecca there. Uh, another little fake projection here as well. Ooh, beautiful plays, dude. The Rebecca is killing it. Great first gen from those survivors as well. Big one, nicely done. And as far as I know, we didn't proc Jolt anywhere else in this uh, area, so I think uh, gens are going to be slow going at first. Let's go ahead. We're going to hang on this scourge hook here, uh, see if we get any more tracking information, and uh, see if we can get started on another gen. Throwing a lot of snow as well. Beautiful. All right, so we're going to project over here. Nice. Okay, yeah, so this gen, this gen is a good amount of progress, all things considered. A little bit of a mind game, big one. Ooh, Elodie, nice and done. All right, well played. Good job not dropping the pallet either. Uh, we're going to kick this, get a little bit of surveillance on it as well, just so we know if anyone else is uh, stealthing in the area and looking to pick up the gen. Let's head back down, and yeah, we do have Elodie here. Coming this way. Good job, dude. Big, big job with the, the mind games here. The survivors are absolutely killing it. I've, I've been doing a lot of swinging. Did we? Oh, it was that dream snare. Okay. Yeah, Eldie moving up to Shag. Nice done. I don't believe a tap on the gen, which is really good news for us at the moment. All right, and we might be able to catch her here. Uh, she could drop pallet. Nicely done. Well, almost a sun there. Well played. Woo, and a good blind as well. All right, let's get ready to uh, snare, set our snare here on the corner. Nicely played. Uh, let's put a projection way down this way, as I think that's... Oh, she's not headed out yet. All right, beautiful, beautiful. Job. Dude, Elodie, nicely played. All right. Um, she back? Dude, she's doing a great job. <laughs> she's confusing the hell out of me. 
Well played. I'm surprised we got that. Well done, though. Well done. All right. Uh, we'll get throwing up very, very, very quickly here as well. See if we can get another skirt trick going. Well, let's take a look with throwing. See where they're hanging out at. Mm -hmm. uh, and let's just go over this good trick kind of center area. See what we can do. Uh, so I believe they are on that gen. So we'll get ready to do a little bit of a teleport. And we'll see where our scourge procs. Honestly, done. I think they let off just in time, dude. Well playing. All right, we do have a boon inside this uh, main area as well. Well playing, Steve. Go ahead and get this uh, kick down. And we might want to get rid of the boon. I don't know if it's going to be <sighs> placed upstairs. It might be. That, that would be my, my best guess as to where the boon is, but, uh, you know, you never know. <laughs> Could be hidden somewhere inside main, too. All right. That's a vault there. That's snare as well. Uh, beautiful. Oh, well done. I honestly thought we would have that, but well played to the Steve. That's huge. All right. Uh, let's try and get Steve down here very quick. Beautiful. No proc on the jolt. Uh, up on the shoulder. And then let's, uh, let's hit up our skirt trick once more. And the Scourge, honestly, uh, has been doing a lot of work for us, keeping a lot of that gen pressure as low as can be. Uh, thrilling still on cooldown, but not a problem. I'll play. Let's head back there. Surveillance letting us know uh, this gen is either regressed or somebody did tap it. Beautiful. Looks like we had a tap on May. Big one. Nicely played. All right, so we got two survivors in this area. Put a little snare back on that vault just in case they uh, loop back around that way. Snare here. Well played. Very close. All right, there's a little bit of jolt on that gen there as well. Fantastic. Ooh, good attempt. Good attempt, Elody. Very close. Well played. All right, let's get another scourge going. We can honestly maybe put a little bit of pressure on this last person and try and go for the 4K a little early here. Uh, we'll see what ends up happening. Well played. Beautiful job, man. And honestly, great job with the chases very early on there. Uh, that, that did... Uh, I mean, dude, they got me... <laughs> they got me swinging a time or two, so that was fantastic. All right, we'll trade here with Rebecca, hopefully. I'm playing. I think gen pressure relatively uh, right now is going to be a little bit lower, which is A-OK. -okay. I mean, they are uh, a little bit, you know, trying to get some chases done, get healed up, get uh, regrouped, all the good stuff. Uh, hopefully no dead heart here. I'm playing. Nicely done. No jolt proc either. Is Steve still hanging around? I don't know. All right. Uh, I don't believe so. Beautiful. Nice. Honestly, very efficient with the hook there, Steve. That was, bit, that was wonderful. All right, uh, let's head back over this way. We'll do another scourge, just make sure no gens are getting picked up very quickly. And then uh, we're going to go see if we can find that other slug or teammate's healing. To believe, I believe healing at the current moment. Let's take a listen here. All right, we do have uh, one survivor. Yep, picked up. Beautiful. Pick him on. Nice done. Beautiful. A little bit more jolt value there as well. So I, I honestly, the reason I really like this build is you can get a ton of great flashy save, by the way. That was fantastic. Uh, you can get a ton of value both close and far on the gens, which I think uh, makes the build very, very, very much worthwhile. Absolutely. Oh, I swung a little early. Oh, <laughs> well played, Meg. Nicely done. Nicely done. All right, we'll just do a normal hook here. Get another quick hook going. They are getting healed up really quick, which is fantastic. Let's get this broken down. Uh, let's see if surveillance is telling us anything. Still regressing there. Uh, let's do a little bit of a, a far teleport, potentially, because I think they might be hanging out on the, the far end of the map now. All right, beautiful. We do have Steve-O here. Put one on this uh, vault. Kind of pretend we're going in this way. And back around. All right, big one. I'll play it, Steve. Beautiful job. And honestly, th these survivors are absolutely killing it with the red stain mining games. A lot of the time you can trick survivors into doing uh, just vaults and whatnot with those uh, stain mining games. And let me just say, these guys are not falling for it, dude. So they're doing a fantastic job. All right, let's see where Steve-O headed. Probably back down this way. Uh, this vault is going to be a little bit harder if they choose to use it. I don't believe dead hard from Steve. I could be wrong, but I, I don't believe so. All right, well played. Uh, looks like that gen has been picked up again. Let's get a scourge truck going, hopefully to prevent a little bit. And we did get a little bit of jolt value there as well. All right, here we go. Well played. All right, so Scourge did proc. So my guess is they're trying to get this gen going. Ooh, I like the flashbang, man. That was a very nice attempt there. Great idea, very creative. All right, see where she's headed. Um, I could stop and kick a gen, but I think we'll uh, I think we'll keep going for the chase here. All right, we're gonna put one down here. A little bit of a bait and big swing. Ooh, well played, beautiful job. Uh, let's follow it through. Ooh, she didn't leave the tile. Fantastic, Meg. All right, walking around this way. We're going to kind of pretend, just in case she double backs once more. All right, beautiful. And looks like, I mean, they are regrouped really, really, really well right now. So they are absolutely killing it. Um, You know, I think they are on that top gen. 
But uh, we'll see if we can get going on make here. Maybe get some quick jolt value and uh, keep going on our gens. They do have a lot of really spread out gen progress, which is going to be very beneficial for them, especially during that late game. Uh, but we'll see what we can do. I don't believe we still have a snare up here. As far as I know, we're going to bait there. Just while we're getting this pressure, there's the boon. I'm going to snuff that very quickly as well. That'll be good to get rid of. And then, uh, honestly, we're going to leave Chase and maybe commit to this uh, teleport here. They might not be expecting it because we have done a few baits uh, here and there. So let's see what we can do. Great finish on that gen, by the way. Beautiful. We do have Steve here. Let's get another chase going. Cod has been used as well, which will uh, definitely definitely work in our favor. Bring him on. Nice done. Do some blood. So we have another injured survivor around. I'm not totally exactly sure where. Uh, I'm super... <laughs> at the current moment, I'm a little worried about this gen. They might have honestly moved on to some other gens, getting some other stuff done. Um, but we'll, we'll worry about this here. All right, now let's head back. All right, we definitely have one survivor over here in the distance. Let's go this way. Uh, looks like Elodie coming down this way. See if she's pulling all the way through. Beautiful. All right, we did flush a few people out with that uh, nice bait there. Time to go on that way. We should be able to pull an M1. Well played, Rebecca. Beautiful. All right, we do have two survivors injured. Not too bad. Ooh, she's, is she still playing the pallet? Did she go? She went upstairs. Hmm. Let's see. Think vaulting through. I'm just curious if she's going to come all the way. Yep, that worked out. That worked out for us. This is going to be a little bit of a mind game here. Yeah, good patience, honestly. On her part, that was beautiful. All right, someone back on that gen as well. Bait through, and then uh, we'll try and get the down here for Jolt. Beautiful, and we got him off the gen just for a moment there. That worked out very nicely. Bring him on. Great dead heart. Fantastic play. Think pulling all the way through. Beautiful, Rebecca. Great distance there. That was fantastic. All right, another boon being set as well. Beautifully played. Bring him on. Nice done. All right, there's our jolt value. Uh, a little bit of a bait here just before we do the pickup. And then we'll get a skirt trick going as well. All right, uh, let's get her back on this hook here. See what we can do with that. Oh, play it, dude. They are killing it. The gen pressure is really, really, really flying at the moment. All right, one survivor out. Uh, looks like they are working on that gen there. Yeah, so uh, part of the reason I love this build is you're very easily able to keep track of the gens the survivors want to get done, right? Um, while you're doing chases, while you're picking up survivors. And uh, so, yeah, it, it, it's a nice, very, very good, like, tracking tool in that way. Ooh, making another lap. I like it. Oh, play. Come around this way. Nicely done. Good call on that pallet. That was huge. All right, uh, let's get ready. We might honestly go for the teleport just to keep our gen pressure safe for the time being. We do have the boon up as well. So uh, LD might have the option to heal here herself. If they do have circle of healing. Nicely done. Well played. Good job getting out of there. All right. Let's see what they added. It is Steve. Uh, I believe probably coming down to this gen. Uh, so I think now the gen I'm most worried about is that far one just on the right there. Uh, but let's see what Steve is able to do. We do have LD here as well. Big swing. Nicely done. Great call on that by LD. That was fantastic. All right, let's get it kicked. And now that we have Steve away from the gen as well, I think we'll pick back up on LD and uh, see if we can make something out of this chase. She honestly could go for this pallet and just pre-throw. Make a little bit more distance, which I think she might do. Oh, looks like she's playing it. Beautiful. Big him on. Nice. Snare definitely helped us out there. Uh, I'm just want to make sure Steve isn't waiting for that pallet save. I don't believe so. We do have, yep, there we go. All right. See, uh, the surveillance helped me a ton there because I was like, wait, that gen, <laughs> that gen's been picked up again. All right, let's do, well, we can probably get Meg down as well. She got that blighted serum. Any balanced? Great balance play. That was fantastic. All right, we'll let her be. Put a snare there as well. Here's Steve O coming for the pickup. Pick him one. That's it done. Nice. All right, let's get rid of the pallet. Good pickup, dude. Fantastic. All right, I think LD's still over here. Yeah, well played, though, dude. Good attempt at that pickup. That was very, very, very close. All right, and we do have a skirt trick back here as well. Get a little bit more pressure going. Beautiful. So I, I think the biggest thing with this build is as long as you can keep some efficient chases, you you end up getting a lot of map pressure that you might not always get, right? Uh, so I, I think it works out pretty nicely. Not right, beautiful. We do have Steve here. Oh, we got Meg there as well. Um, let's get rid of the power first and foremost. Uh, let's put another snare right here. Might come in handy. Hi, Meg. Big one. And I do want to go take care of that boon, if at all possible. I'm going to put some, uh, some fake pressure here, just while we're walking upstairs. 
And let's get rid of this boon. Because if we can keep them injured, we're going to get even even more value out of Jolt every time we do it, right? Um, and it's definitely going to help keep our chases super short as well. All right, I would suspect someone may be coming in for the save. Relatively soon, yep. There's Steve. I think a trade, most likely. Which we'll take. That'll be good. Oh, we got Meg here as well. All right. All right. I like it. Awesome. I, I love that they're they're very in it for the teamwork, right? They're they're here to <laughs> help each other out, get those hooks going. I love it, dude. That's that's some great team play. All right, we got one played. Um, I think Eldie's still here. Leave that there. Is she? Ah, oh, they might have headed out. Well played. All right, uh, let's do a little teleport here. Wonderful. Oh, uh, we'll kick this with surveillance. I, I don't know that they're really too concerned about that one. Um, I honestly think it's the one that's almost done there. And then they might have been putting some more pressure on this backside. Let's see if the boon is back upstairs once more. I believe it is beautiful. This will be helpful for us. Uh, let's drop a snare here. Meg is asleep, so uh, hopefully this will help us out. Uh, she could just go window side as well. So we'll see what she ends up doing. Beautiful. Well played. All right. Uh, so let's get the boon out of the way. Beautiful. And we're going to come back in and then drop in case Meg kind of runs inside, but I don't know that she will. Let's see if she headed out anywhere here. Oh, I think still up top, honestly. All right, so we can maybe force her into that snare uh, if we try for it here. Maybe a vault. I mean, we should be able to just take the down. We're going to wait for her to drop. Oh, I forgot about the balanced. <laughs> well played, Meg. That's fantastic. Oh, my goodness. Slipped my memory. All right, uh, let's see where she heads. Beautiful job, though. Nice routing, honestly. Uh, I was going to say, I don't think we have that pallet up. All right, make him one here. Nicely done. Well played. A little bit of a uh, jolt pressure there. Looks like uh, I think that Jen probably regressed all the way. I don't think Elodie's over there, but could be. We'll see. All right. Uh, is this hook? This hook is down. Yes. All right. And then let's go. I guess we'll just hang on a normal hook over on this side. See what we can make happen with that. Beautiful. All right, so honestly, I mean, some pretty dang good pressure out of this build, all things considered. Uh, nice tracking, you know. Thrilling is a bit of a hit or miss perk, right? Um, but I think overall, it does fit nicely into just helping you, like, especially if you can't get to a scourge hook or you're not getting a lot of value out of jolt at a certain moment. It, it really can just guide you sort of in that right direction. Um, so, I, you know, I like that part of it. Although, <laughs> let's see the void energy. Why not for the for the Halloween event, right? <laughs> All right, uh, let's head over this way. See what we can find. A right, beautiful job. Well, not bad. Not a bad 3K need. Well played to each and every one of the survivors. And nicely, nicely done, dude. We'll wish them some GGs. And uh, let's get ready to jump on over. Well played, dude. Nicely done. Alrighty, looks like we are spawning on on the game, Gideon Meat Plant. Uh, so let's see what we can do. Uh, this will be a bit of a more interesting map for the build. I'm not totally sure how it's gonna go, um, but I think it will be. I think it'll be good. I think it'll be fun, uh, and we'll uh, we'll see if we can get ready to rock and roll. <laughs> a little turned around when I started out there. Um, I think Jolt will be pretty effective this uh, map. A Skirt Trick RNG can definitely, uh, I don't, definitely bite you a little bit on, on some maps like this. But uh, nonetheless, we're gonna get uh, going. See if we can figure out which gen they're hanging out on, and uh, see if we can get ready to rock and roll. All right, beautiful. And we did find a survivor here, um, and we do have some survivors on this gen here. So let's uh, let's take that up first. She might drop early. Beautiful. Well played. Nice and done, Michaela. Get it broken down. That'll be good uh, about to have out of the way for later as well. Um, additionally, it might be, you know, we might have some tougher chases uh, just due to Freddy being uh, an essentially an M1 killer, uh, not having a whole lot of that. You know, not essentially not chase power because we do have those dream snares, um, but definitely, you know, definitely a lot of pellets and a lot of mind games to be had. Great first gen, by the way. Beautifully, beautifully done. Uh, let's see if we can get going on my kit. We'll do a little bit of a bait here. See if she pulls into that room. I don't believe she did. Beautifully done. We did get Claude Claudette off there. Well played. Nice. Good, good. I like the respect strategy there. That was fantastic. All right, we should be able to get at least one hit going. Played. Uh, we can maybe get going on Michaela here as well. We're going to put a snare there just in case she double backs on us. She wants to pull tight. Beautiful. All right, we got a little bit of distance off from that as well. Uh, big one here. Nicely done. Good job not dropping the pallet either. That was fantastic. Uh, let's bait a different gen. Just try and keep some passive uh, passive pressure going if we can. All right, uh, let's put a snare here. Put one there. Well, nicely done. Well played. Did a great job with the chases thus far. They're absolutely killing it. Bait there as well. No missed skill checks so far, so they're, uh, they're killing it on that front. A lot of times you can freak survivors out with those uh, projections, get some missed skill checks, but so far they are absolutely winning. Nice to All right, let's get another uh, break here. Beautiful. 
So essentially, I think we're going to have to kind of run out some of the resources, and then uh, our chases should get a little bit easier after the fact, but we also need to make sure um, we can sort of get a down before these resources go, you know, before... Oh, great dead hard! Fantastic! Fantastic. But yeah, we need to make sure uh, they don't get all the gens done before we're, uh, like, you know, <laughs> done with the resources, essentially, right? Oh, played. Beautiful, great gen there. Big and one, nicely done. All right, no jolt value, but that's a-okay. Uh, we're gonna do a little bit of bait just before we pick up. And then uh, hopefully we'll have a skirt hook somewhere close, uh, but we'll kind of have to read the room. Read the room, see what we can do. All right, beautiful, I don't believe so. Uh, thrilling should help us out a little bit. Uh, I actually don't know that they're currently working on a jet. So we might be in okay shape. Yeah, I think uh, gen progress has uh, ceased for the moment uh, or people hopped off, but uh, we'll see. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. All right, let's head over this way. We do, uh, we do have a survivor here. All right, beautiful job, Claudette. Well played. She might be coming through. Yeah, beautiful. That worked out for us nicely. She does have a very good pallet in the back uh, area here, kind of towards the bathroom. We're going to leave uh, a snare right there and then uh, try and come around this way. Maybe slow her down on rotation. I will leave one more here. Nice. Good time to drop, honestly. That was wonderful. And let's maybe get ready to leave the chase as well. Let's see. Yeah, let's go downstairs. Maybe we should leave this area. Beautiful. All right, and let's look around for some survivors. Uh, see if we can get some more pressure going. We do have some uh, very fresh scratch marks here. Beautiful. It is unfortunately Michaela again. Hopefully, uh, we can sort of leave her alone, especially if we find another survivor or something. Uh, but for the, for the time being, we definitely need to get that <laughs> our gen pressure up and going. Oh, good job. Nice done. Uh, let's honestly leave this chase. Leave this one as well. Let's see where we can go. I'm hoping we can kind of catch a survivor by surprise working on a gen. Maybe get some pressure going that way. All right, I don't think we have anyone there. Let's head over this way, see what we can do. All right, beautiful. I do believe we have a survivor or two up top. Let's check this out. Wonderful. Oh, hello. <laughs> All right, we'll get going on chase. Now well played. You gotta, you gotta let them boys at the void energy, you know what I mean? <laughs> All right, let's see where they head. Uh, good finish on that. Let's actually go there. All right, beautiful. Uh, big one. Good, uh, good spin there. She almost had me on that. That was wonderfully played. All right, good job. That was great riding. Good job making some distance there as well. Big pull on that. Nicely done. Yeah, if we can get some more jolt value going very quick, I think that'll definitely help us out. And we're gonna definitely need, uh, we're definitely gonna need some uh, gen pressure to make a comeback out of this. Well played. Uh, we do have another survivor here. Let's take a hit at the very least. Ooh, comp spirit. I like that. You, you don't see Calm Spirit a bunch these days. <laughs> All right, let's see if we can find a Scourge Hook. Uh, we do have one over there. I think we'll be able to make it. And I believe that Jen did get picked up. All right. Let's see this right here. Wonderfully played. Beautiful job, Michaela. Fantastic. All right, let's do a little bit of a bait here. Good job. All right, that is Kate. Protection hit potentially from Claude. Ooh, beautiful job with that sprinter. So that's nicely, nicely played. Put a snare here. Well played. Very close. I like it. I like it. All right. Uh, let's kick it down. Uh, we can get K on a skirt trick as well. I think that is also going to be very helpful for us, but we'll see what we can do. All right. Let's do... It might be a little bit tougher to make it to one. I think we're going to resort to a normal hook. See what we can do uh, starting out there. And then we'll probably sort of, oops, <laughs> didn't mean to swing. Uh, head towards uh, where they got the unhook. See if we can uh, get some pressure going that way. We'll leave a snare here as well, just in case. All right, looks like that gen is still regressing, as far as we know. Oh, let's drop down. All right, no one there. Sounds like that gen's quiet as well. Um, all right, beautiful, we do have a survivor here. Nice, nice, nice. All right, let's head up this way. See what they can do. All right, we do have Claude here. Uh, if she does take the pallet, which she very well could, but I think we'll leave and go for whoever did the save on this. Beautiful. We got Jane here. Big one. That's it done. Good job not throwing the pallet either. Ooh, I think she's waiting on it a little bit. Beautiful, Jane. That was actually nicely played. All right. Uh, let's try and see if we can get a little bit of jolt value here. A little bit of more, a little bit more information. Big one. Well played. All right. No jolt. Uh, and no one's picked up that gen yet. So we're doing okay on the gen pressure. Oh, no. No. <laughs> Great save, Claude. That's fantastic. I actually didn't think she was going to be in the area. So that was nicely, nicely played. Beautiful job. Good double blind there as well. All right. Let's walk forwards. And, you know, we do want to go for Jane. I think, honestly, what we're going to do is teleport out here and come back in. Looks like uh, they went upstairs. If that is Jane, I could be very wrong about that. I think it is. 
Big him up, big him up. Oh, big swing. <laughs> well played, well played. All right, big him on here. That's done. All right, there's a little bit of jolt value for us. That did help out a lot. Uh, Surveillance will let us know if anyone's getting back on those generators as well. Uh, but up we go. And let's see if we can find a Scourge Hook. Yeah, we do have one here. I think we can definitely make it to this one. Let's give it a go. Definitely someone picking that gen back up or regressed all the way, but I think someone was on it. All right, let's do this hook here. Up we go. Well played. Beautiful job, Jane. And let's make a teleport and see if they we can get him to come out this way. Beautiful job. All right, we did get that sprint burst going early, which is really big for us. Definitely help us in this chase. Big one here. Oh, good attempt with the flashbang. I like it. Well played. Oh, she, she didn't quite make it over. Well played, though. All right, up we go. And let's do, let's do this right here. So it is, it is interesting. I feel like this build can help you to get, like, some pressure back as the game goes on um because it's you know it's a it's a it can be a tricky build if you're not if you're not getting downs and hooks uh, i i don't think it works quite as effectively as uh, a lot of the other builds you could do on both freddy and a lot of other killers uh, but i think all in all it is a it is a good build if you're able to get some of those chases going and able to put some of that pressure on for sure and uh it feels like the the better you're doing in chases the more effective the build is good breathe throw i like that the blind there as well i'm right, gonna look up walk forward Nicely done. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll gander a guess that she's pulling all the way through. I'll play it, Claude. Put one here. And put one on the pallet as well. That should slow her down just a little bit for us. Beautiful. Maybe she, she won't make as much distance there. A little bit to the right, I believe. Beautiful job. Someone on the jet. We're going to bait a teleport. Big one here. Nicely done. I'll play it, Claude. A little bit of jolt by down there as well. Nice. All right. Ah, uh, do we have a Scourge Hook near? I don't believe so. All right, so we'll go for a normal hook here, teleport over there. Um, we might commit to the teleport because we have been faking it a few times over and over. Uh, so we might commit to it. Let's check it out, though. Let's check it out. Nicely done. All right, we got Jane here. We come on. Play, see where she heads. We have someone actually working as well. Yeah, we do have Michaela here. I'm dropping the pallet. I like it. Uh, we'll drop a snare back here just in case anyone uh, comes out that way if we ever do a uh, teleport back to that gen. That's where Michaela's headed. All right, we are going to have to be a little bit quicker about a chase because they are back on those gens getting that pressure rocking and rolling. Uh, so we'll see what we can do with this. Nice right, so done. Well played. Great stun there. All right, we might leave this chase if we don't get a hit by the time our uh, power is recharged. Uh, we'll kind of see what we can do about that. All right, beautiful. Add-on's doing some work for us there with the tracking and the blood as well. Uh, but let's go up top again. Let's go up top. Beautiful. I don't think anyone here. Let's give it a kick so we can watch it with surveillance. Fantastic. And then uh, let's go listen to our other gen down this way. I want to make sure they didn't switch gens. Did I just see someone? I believe I did. Hi, Jane. <laughs> we'll play. All right, let's see where Jane heads. Nice. And we have gotten a, a good, uh, like gotten rid of a good amount of the resources on the top floor here so that'll definitely definitely help us out uh i think headed downstairs beautiful uh do you have dead heart nice well played all right uh let's get the scourge going maybe prevent that gen there good pallet save i think yes nicely done they are on top of the pallet saves absolutely absolutely all right probably a vault yes beautiful headed through as far as i know nice and some lied there from jane that was wonderful Absolutely. All right, I think our jolt's going to help us out here. If we can get another uh, gen down. Good attempt from Claude. I like to see it. That was nice. Maybe take a hit here as well. Get a little bit more of that pressure going. Beautiful. Well played. Uh, let's bait down there just in case they're trying to get that going. All right, up we go. Hi, Claude. Oh, good job with the dead herb. All right, beautiful. Gen out of the way. Uh, let's go to this skirt truck. Because I think Claude's definitely going to have to mend, and we can maybe get another jam one with uh, Jolt there as well. Might help us out a ton. Beautiful. Um, let's put pressure on Michaela because she is up here. She might even go for a trade. We'll have to see. Uh, but for the time being, we'll try and get someone down. Get some more Jolt. Uh, big M1. Just out of range. Well played. Well played. I think we have someone else here. Beautiful. Uh, let's follow this. Yeah, we have Claude here as well. Beautiful. What we want to see. Well played. There's some jolt for us. Beautiful. Let's try and take one more hit. 
So we keep the, the sort of the healing train going for these survivors. Big them on. Nicely done. Let's get uh, Jolt or uh, let's get Squad back up on a hook. Put a little bit of uh, fake teleport pressure there. Wonderful. Up we go. The pallet saves have been really big this game. That has been absolutely phenomenal, I will say. That has been absolutely huge. I think they are going to try pretty hard to get this last gen going, which is not bad, dude. All right, up we go. We'll play quad. Fantastic. Uh, we'll leave a snare there. Just slow down some progress, maybe. Uh, let's do this. Interesting. Okay, nice save there. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Let's go for Michaela here. Claude might want that BT hit. Not opposed to. Well played. And I'm really... I, I feel like we just got to watch that gen pretty close. All right, let's see where Michaela's going, though. Big one here. I love how... <laughs> I've had the purple glyph floating around as well, dude. All right. Because that gen still looks like it's regressing as well. Back we go. Claude running around. Beautiful job with that. Ah, that wasn't the greatest snare I've ever put down. I think we had another survivor here as well. There's Kate, beautiful. Let's go for her. Pick him on. Nice done. Nice job with that sprint burst as well. I maybe should have stopped a kick just so we can keep an eye on that gen. Uh, we are gonna route back that way because hey, I'm I'm very afraid of this <laughs> gen getting done at the current moment. We do have a Kayla here. Let's give it a kick though. Let me watch it. So I, and I think the surveillance is really important in this build because you can, you know, give something even just a simple kick and then with your teleport ability, go back to it, which I think is huge. All right, let's try and go for a down here on Kate, potentially. We can, even if we take another hit on Jane, I'm not too opposed. I think that'll be good for us. Played. Both gens still untouched, which is good. Oh, there we go. So th that's the nice part. You can kind of just decide when you need to leave that chase to protect your gen. Hello, I'm playing. Almost got away with that mind game. That was pretty big. All right, let's give it a kick. Head over this way. I think they are going to be trying to loop this just a little bit. Put our stain here. Bring him on. Nice done. Fantastic dead hard. That was incredible timing, Claude. All right, let's see where she heads. Uh, ideally, I think we need to get another down. We'll keep an eye on the gen. I don't know if she'll pull all the way through or not. Beautiful. Uh, let's put one here. Put one here as well. Let's go ahead and break. I think probably headed to freezer would be my guess. And maybe of all, uh, we need to go to gen though. Gotta protect it! Fantastic, there's Jane. Good job, they got healed up really quick. That was fantastic. Well played, beautiful. Get this kicked. Set back to Jen. Yeah, they really want this Jen. Well played, Michaela. Beautiful job. Give it a kick. And I think, honestly, since they've been uh, very fixated in this area, we can put a few snares down just to sort of help out that early pressure. I am also a little bit worried about this, Jen. Let's go. Let's go take a, a quick look. All right. Nobody there. I'm going to double check on our other bottom gen very, very, very fast. And then uh, we'll head back upstairs. Ooh, so good job, Claude. The dead arts have been on point. Absolutely. Absolutely. All right. They are back on that gen. Let's try and get Claude out. Uh, maybe onto a scourge if we do have one down here. But if not, uh, we'll get at least one survivor out of this trial. Ah, beautiful. We have a scourge arc. That'll help us out a ton. All right. Up we go. Beautiful. Played. Um, let's go to someone else here. Do we? Yes, we do. Well, we get one. Well played. Our mind game worked there a little bit. Let's snare down as well. All right. And then we got to head back up top. Because they are going to want to get this gen out of the way. Fantastic. Dude, really good job with the gen pressure. I won't lie. They are putting up a really, really nice fight. So they are absolutely killing it on that front. All right. Uh, let's maybe... Because I think whoever whoever we go after, the other is going to leave and go back to that gen, right? Let's see. Yeah, Kate's on her way back. Let's try and intercept that. Maybe get a little bit of jolt value here. And another survivor out. I think that'll be very helpful. Big one. Nice done. Well played. All right. There's some jolt. <laughs> I was not expecting the flashbang here. Absolutely nice job. All right, and then let's do the skirt hook. All right, beautiful. And this should proc on that gen. Hopefully, if, that, if it does have the most. Yeah, beautiful. Get a little bit of this going. See if they run out. I think they went up. Oh, beautiful. Hello, Jane. Hello, Jane. <laughs> All right, see what she heads to. Give her an M1 here. Nicely done. I'm playing. Beautiful. 
Yeah, so it is It is interesting because, the, you know, thrilling can get in the way of some of the other perks working, right? If the entity is blocking it, it won't um, inherently regress from some of our other perks we have uh, on the field here. But it's, uh, it, it, I think, all in all, the build sort of works. Um, you know, and, and thrilling really is a nice backup for when those other perks aren't working, uh, especially even uh, beginning of the game. Uh, I was in desperate need of figuring out where the survivors are and whatnot. So, uh, I, I, you know, I think it does work for the build. Um, definitely maybe something you could trade out, but uh, oh no, I, I really do enjoy the perk. All right, uh, big one here. It's a dungeon well played and we got one survivor left. I you know, and honestly, I think the build really <laughs> Saved our skin on this uh, on, on this game I, I honestly don't know with some uh, you know different perks and whatnot I don't think we would have been able to pull a 3k potentially 4k here on this match So uh, that honestly worked out very well for us. All right. Well played Jane. Nicely done All right, uh, let's head downstairs. They will be hunting around for hats down here most likely as it can only spawn downstairs, but uh, you never know. <laughs> uh, let's take a look around. Uh, did I see somebody? I don't think I did. I uh, will put one on a pallet just in case they're running us down here. All right, let's take a listen for a hatch. See if we can find it. I think we'll be, and it, she is injured as well. There she is, beautiful. Let's try and snag this 4K. Uh, we'll do that in case she double backs. Good job. The distance pulling is really good, especially when you're just looking for a hatch rather than rotating through tiles. All right, big one. Great dead hard. Fantastic play there. And I think we should be able to intercept her here. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> She'll make the hatch, dude. Uh, that dead hard play was fantastic. Absolutely one of that game. But uh, yeah, everyone, that is the build. It is lots of fun, works very well. And uh, yes, thank you all so much. I appreciate you tuning in and uh, we'll catch you next time around. Let's get these uh, some GGs, but thank you all. I appreciate it.